The Battle of Transylvania was the first major operation of the Romanian forces campaign during World War I, beginning on 27 August 1916. It started as an attempt by the Romanian army to seize the disputed province of Transylvania, and potentially knock Austria-Hungary out of the war. Although initially successful, the offensive was brought to a halt after Bulgaria's attack on Dobruja. Coupled with a successful German and Austro-Hungarian counterattack after September 18, the Romanian army was eventually forced to retreat back to the Carpathians by late October. Topic. Background Before the war, the Kingdom of Romania was an ally of Austria-Hungary, however, when war broke out in 1914 Romania pledged neutrality, claiming that Austria-Hungary had started the war and thus Romania had no obligation to join it. Romania eventually joined the Entente, on the condition that the Allies recognize Romanian authority over Transylvania, Romanians being the majority population in the region. The Allies accepted the terms, and Romania declared war on Austria-Hungary on 27 August. Topic. Battle Topic: Romanian offensive, the 27th of August to the 18th of September. On the night of the 27th of August, three Romanian armies crossed the largely undefended Carpathian passes, meeting only sporadic resistance by Austro-Hungarian border units. The Romanian plan hypothesis Z called for a rapid advance to the strategically important Mureș River with Budapest as the ultimate target. The main advance was carried on by the Second Army, with the First and Fourth on its flanks. The Second Army crossed the border on the night of 27–28 August and advanced into Transylvania. In the first phase of the offensive, the 27th of August to the 2nd of September, the Second Army conquered the Lepsa, Putna, Naruha, and Zabala valleys and advanced towards Kovasna. Fierce fighting took place at Vama Buzolui, with the Romanians capturing the town, inflicting heavy losses on the opposing forces, totaling 132 dead and wounded, and another 492 prisoners. On 29 August the city of Brasov was captured, and on 31 August, the villages of Tohanul No and Tohanul Vechi were captured. On 2 September the first phase of the Romanian offensive was over, with the Second Army reaching the Catalina Zabala de Barlau Prejmer Feldior of Ladini line. To the north of the Second Army, the Fourth Army conquered the Tulges Pass and advanced westwards. To the west, the First Army crossed the border on its entire length and captured the city of Orsova before advancing towards the outskirts of Sibiu. In the second phase of the offensive 3-10 September, the Second Army crossed the Olt River and captured Svantu Gheorghe on 7 September. By the end of the second phase, the Second Army controlled all of the Brasov Depression, reaching the Catalina Arcus Valsiel Feldiora Circaea Cinca Vesh line. In the third phase, 11 to 18 September, the Second Army conquered Moresti, forced the crossing of the Olt at Ripea, and obtained a foothold to conquer Deasora. Here the Romanian troops benefited from the support of local people, with a young woman from Parau village guiding a Romanian sub-unit behind enemy positions. On 19 September the Second Army was ordered to adopt a defensive posture on the ground captured and hold the Oder He Palos Pfizer Deasora Taikasu no Toarkla Sisals Romanu no Cartasora Avrig line. During the 29 days of the operation, the Second Army averaged over 100 kilometers (62 miles) distance of penetration of enemy lines. During the Romanian offensive, the Austro-Hungarian motor cannon wagon was destroyed by Romanian artillery. This was an armored self-propelled rail car armed with a turreted 7 cm gun. 
It was the sole example made, and the most futuristic looking piece of Austro Hungarian rail armor. At the end of the offensive, the Romanians were in control of almost a third of Transylvania, 7,000 square miles or 18,000 square km. This area comprised the entirety of four administrative departments Brasso, Sik, Fogaras and Haramsik and parts of five others. Up to this time, the Romanians had captured 7,000 prisoners. <inaudible> <inaudible> Central Powers Counter-Offensive the 26th of September to the 25th of October Erich von Falkenhayn, recently fired as Chief of Staff, assumed command of the 9th Army and began a counterattack against the Romanians. On 18 September German forces struck the Romanian 1st Army near Hateg, forcing them to stop their advance and switch to defence. Eight days later the elite Alpen Corps took the city of Sibiu, and on 17 October the Romanian 2nd Army was defeated at Brasov. The 4th Army, despite little pressure from the enemy, retreated to the mountains. By 25 October the Romanian troops were routed and withdrew to their pre-war positions, but managed to repulse German and Austro-Hungarian attempts to break through the Prahava Valley and into Bucharest via the shortest route, as the Germans had planned. Aftermath After pushing the Romanian army back to the Carpathians, the Germans began their conquest of Oltenia. They entered the region on 26 October and reached Targu Ju the next day, where their advance was halted by stiff Romanian resistance. The Romanians counter-attacked on the following day, pushing the Germans back towards the border. On 29 October the Germans regrouped, and on 1 November they launched a much more powerful attack. The Romanians could not repel the renewed German attack and, by the middle of November, Targu Ju was in their hands. They continued their advance, and on 21 November the regional capital Craiova was occupied. The last significant action of the battle was the charge of Robonesti on 23 November, one of the most daring actions by the Romanian army. By 26 November all of Oltenia had been seized by the Germans, pushing the Romanian forces east of the Olt River. The next day they began their advance towards Bucharest, the Romanian capital. The Hungarian cultural area After the Romanian army withdrew from Transylvania, in July 1917, the Hungarian government created the Hungarian cultural area, comprising the mainly Romanian inhabited Craso Zoreni, Hunyad, Sheban, Fogaras, and Brasso counties on the border with Romania. These counties welcomed the Romanian troops when they invaded, so they were united in this cultural area in order to prevent them from any exposure to foreign influence. By the end of the war, over 3,000 Romanian primary schools were closed. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Battle maps. equals equals notes <laughs>